Greetings fellow operators. Today we're going to discuss how to input a slope or swale into your dozer file that's not actually designed into the GPS file for the job. Say for example, you've got some standing water on the side here that you'd like to get moved and you want to cut a swale in. Well, you can input a swale in the cab right here without any input from the office. So the first thing I'm going to show you here is the blade tip focus. This red box right here on the blade, that's telling me that the blade tip focus is on the right side of the blade. If I hit this top button here, that box moves to the left side. So you need to know which side of the blade you're, you're focused on. We're going to go ahead and put that back on the right side. And now we're going to get into the menu and get into how to actually input the slope. We go to a menu button and we hit select design at the very top there. Click OK. And we want to install a new slope right here. It says new slope. It's going to ask us to select the desired coordinate system. It's going to say used last. So, now that, so Monosol is the job that I'm currently working on. So I'm going to click OK. Now, as you'll recall, we put our blade tip focus on the right side. So this is going to be where we want our swale to start. So I'm going to click here. And you'll notice that it inputs all the information for that location. We're going to go to point 2. I'm going to go ahead and raise my blade up. Turn my parking brake off. We're going to track forward a little bit. Let's just say, for example, I'd like the water to drain to this point right here. So I'm going to put my blade tip down again. And I'm going to come back down to my screen and pick here. And again, it inputs all the coordinate information. I'm going to click. I'm going to select the cross slope. Now it's, it's asking me for the bank of my swale. Do I want a swale or do I want a crown? For, this, for the purposes of what we're doing today, we're going to select a swale. So I want the left side of the bank be a 1% and then I'm going to select the next button right here and the right side I also want to be a 1% so right now if you look here the right side of the blade is doing this and the left side of the blade is also doing this so that's not going to work so we need to select this button here and it will change the cross slope. So now the right side of our blade or the right side of our swale is doing this as the left side does this. So now we've created a swale. We'll click OK and it tells you that the design name is slope 17. We'll click OK. That'll take us back out to the menu. We'll select that one. And then we'll click our back button, and it will have our line. So that is the center of our swale that we've created. And our, our slope on this side is going to be going up, and this side on the, on the right is going to be going this way. So we've created a swale. 